see that or not. Hooked up coming right at you. Saw a big something down there. number one these are some of the bigger ones that I caught but they're just on top on the of my bait tube so I prefer to use baits with the with a screwed up mouth first but these will do one of them might have a messed up mouth already actually idea would be to put this bait a ways out there and then the other bait will be short live liner check the drag drag's good so i want more line out than that We'll just have to see what he does. Then bait number two, go out on the jigging rod. Okay, another big one. Want him to go straight down. What the heck is that? That's not really like a wahoo, that's more like a shark. I got my other line out somewhere over here. Such a weird, such a weird hit.
Well, it's a GT that immediately got sharked. So, he's going to go back. Look at that, right in his mouth. There's, that's, that might be my Damashi. <laughs> My Damashi hook right there, the gold hook. He might have been one of the ones who ate my Damashi earlier. That was before sunrise. I hooked up, super weird fight. I caught like half of a, a lua, it's like 10 pounds, but it's got a gold uh, Damashi hook in its mouth. But the situation this morning, I tried turning on my fish finder and it was powering on and off like last time. Although I, after the last trip, I went home, cleaned the terminals, Regreased everything, tested it, and it worked just fine, but I've got some kind of wiring issue. So I'm out here, no fish finder. Feels pretty weird. Um, but my friend Billy is out here, so um, he helped me catch bait or help mark the bait. But uh, I've got a bunch of baits, probably somewhere between eight and ten. I didn't really count, I was just shoving them in the bait tube. He's pretty nervous. Uh, but the bite time this morning is 10.09 to 12.09 for the major bite time. So that'll be about as long as we want to stay out here. Had something had it. <laughs> something just ate my old pillow again. I was just trying to bring it in. It's either a GT or a shark. That just feels like dead weight, like a shark. I'm going to tie a new wire rig onto this pole. At least I got all my leader back. I mean, it sucks to leave that in the shark, but I'm not going to fuck with that. Right at the kayak. Uh, see if I can't catch a few more baits and then get back out there. Real bummer that I missed that Wahoo hit earlier because I think the hits are going to be kind of few and far between today.
I just had another Ono oh hit and picked it up too. Switch the stinger to this rig. Okay, been kinking my wire right there, so I moved the hook up a little bit. Got him that time. Yeah, pretty sure that's a Wahoo. I just hooked into something. It might have been a Wahoo, and then I'm pretty sure I got sharked. Okay, new wire rig tied on. New bait. It's getting so frustrating. But hopefully, we can get the next one. Hooked up coming right at you, like right at you, my bit. It's gonna be under you in a second. It's pretty much straight down. I have no line down. Okay. I took my jigging rod 
and I put it into, I locked down the drag, free spooled it, and then just put it in gear. This thing came hit and just started screaming. This has got to be a pretty big one because it is pulling way harder. Come on, keep the tension, keep the tension, keep the tension, keep the tension. All right, in my leader, what are you? It's got to be a wahoo, nothing else. Pull me around. See something down there, long, skinny. Man, he smoked it. <laughs> Absolutely smoked it. Let's get this thing in before we get sharked. Oh yeah, big wahoo. Big wahoo. <laughs> him. Yeah, a uh, pretty big wahoo. Look at that wahoo, yes! Uh, that's definitely my PB off the kayak. Definitely. Hell yeah. That's such a beautiful fish. All right. Be cool. Be cool. Come on. Be cool. Looks like I got him with the stinger hook right in the corner of the mouth.
Hell yeah! Wahoo! Fucking monster wahoo! Yeah, baby! <laughs> what? Oh yeah! Hell yeah! Ugh! I don't want to take too many chances putting it outside the kayak. Absolutely got slimed. What a beautiful fish. Awesome. I don't know how heavy it is, but I'm guessing like 35 pounds. Oh, hell yeah. I took so many pictures. I've got to have a bunch of good pictures of this guy. Those sharp teeth. I heard something splash back there. Billy's hooked up. Hell yeah. I've got one bait left in there and he's freaking out. Do this kind of quickly. I don't know what is hanging in the water around here. This guy's probably just as long as my fish bag. Yeah. Get up there. It just barely will go in there. Looks like we're coming up on a new current line. It runs through here, so I'm gonna jump to the other side, throw a bait out. It's actually my last bait. I've only got one left since I was really sucking hardcore right before I caught that Ono, oh the Wahoo. <laughs> but, <laughs> but <laughs> heck yeah, hell yeah, fuck yeah. Uh, that was so sweet. That was a good fight too. It fought pretty hard. Uh, but it, it's pretty big. I can't wait to weigh it just to see how big it is. Um, if it's over 40 pounds, I think I'm gonna go have it Gyotaku, uh, which is fish prints. Um, but it's just such an awesome fish and so frustrating. Uh, it's really nice to be hammering them now. That's five off the kayak in the last 10 days or something like that. But you gotta get them all, get them all the Getting's good, I, I suppose. But we'll toss out this other bait. Uh, still don't have my fish finder, so I have no idea how deep I am. I think I'm like 270 to 300 feet. Something's going on. Look at the shutter and the rod tip. Almost felt like something just hit it. But there's something still on there. Maybe it cut the bait in half. See if it comes back for it. Just as I suspected, Wahoo cut it right in half. Just barely, so barely missed the hook. Wow, 